Okay, a new zone, new dragon riding glyphs to get. So let's get our glyphs. So from the starting camp, the first glyph is just a little bit away from the starting camp. As you can see, using if you just use um, handy notes, then you don't really even need this video. I just want to test something as well. So I'm going to try that out. Probably should have actually, you know, located the glyph better. Above the tree. So it should be even higher. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Ah, shit, I forgot to actually do what I was trying. So, the first glyph is at, pretty much, 50, 65, no, 64, on top of the big tree. So yeah, if you use drag, like, if you just use, like, handy notes dragonflight, then it shows where these are. But I want to test something, I want to see whether you can actually grab the glyphs without being on a dragon rider mount. So like, if you have like, just normal flying, because it might make life easier. If you know a blizzard's fucking you over with blood vigor or some bullshit. There it is, okay. can just grab them without a, a dragon riding mount if you want to be more accurate in hitting the glyphs then. So the next, this glyph is at 62.75. So honestly if you want you can just swap yourself to a true mount rather than a dragon riding mount to grab the glyphs. Like, so you don't have to like just struggle to fucking grab them. Of course, it's still faster to fly around with your dragon ride and mount, but for getting more precise stuff, you can just swap to an actual flying mount. Mm Next one is over there on this island at thirty-two eighty-one, just high above this island. It's very obvious where it is. As you can see, I saw it pretty easily. Fair dragon scales. Oh, yeah. Profession items. The druids of the flames seek to bolster their ranks in the Their defenses hurry curse you. Strike them down. And seal their portals. And as I said, mm, the stupid blizzard thing where they won't let you fly, so I guess you just have to swap to a true flying mount if they just decide your vigor is not mm, going to work. Interesting. Okay, so the next glyph is at 3446. In this Big, in this burnt out tree.
Okay, this one is fairly high up in this tree at 46, 46. Show them no mercy! <laughs> okay, this one is on this floating island by the looks of things. In between these two trees. At 60, 30. And then the last two I think are probably near the raid. I think this is where the raid is anyway. So the next two are at 30, 21, the Jordan fires flare once again. and 22, 27. But I'll say it again when I pick up the glyph. The flame elementals are infiltrating new areas of the dream. Snuff them out before they set anything else ablaze. So in this little archway here is where the next glyph was. Luca, Luca, no. Okay, so this glyph was at. Yeah, as I thought, this pole's just bugged. This glyph was at 30, 21. And then the last glyph, I think. Yeah, is the last glyph by the raid, by the things. Interesting. It's just behind the raid, a very big height. Probably at the top of this hill, yep. So for this one, of course, you just pull out your normal flying mount because this one's gonna be a pain in the ass to get to. Otherwise, like you technically have to get like pathfinding, but mm, pathfinding is very easy to do. For like the normal fly mount, you just need to. Um, I suppose you do need to like you need to complete like all the story quests of each of the zones. Uh, what's this one? Again, more story quests. Got to do the caverns story quest. Explore the Dragon Isles, explore the Dream, and explore the Caverns. So just do like all the story quests for the zones, and explore all the zones, and then you get the thing. You don't. And when I say all the zones, I don't mean you have to do the story for this zone. Like you could just have to explore this new Dream Zone. So yep, the last one is at 2127 on top of this big ass hill, which, like I said, will be much easier to get if you actually have um normal flying, but you can fly up there about it. I suppose it's not one of the flags that are really hard to get. So, that is that. 